PTSD, post traumatic stress disorder. This is a condition for individuals who have suffered a terrible traumatic experience in their life. Once you have experienced this terrible traumatic experience in your life, we become lost in trying to figure out how do we coexist with the event that occurred. Well, I want to share with you how I am coexisting and co-living with a terrible traumatic experience that I have experienced in my life. On April 27, 2019, a 19-year-old terrorist reached our synagogue and opened fire right in front of me, killing a woman that I was talking to, Mrs. Lori Lynn Gilbert K. May she rest in peace. And then he lifted his AR-15 to kill me. For a split second, I looked into his eyes. I, I was looking down the barrel of an AR-15. I heard children playing behind me. I turned around to go and try to save as many children as I can. When he shot four bullets out of his very high-powered rifle at me. From the four bullets, two got my fingers, lost my index finger and mangled my other index finger. But the rest of me survived. That was my trauma that I live with every single day. It haunts me every single day. But I made the decision. As soon as I realized how I survived this trauma, that I'm alive to talk about it, that I will not allow the trauma to paralyze me, but I'm going to take the traumatic experience and transform it into an energy to help others. An energy to realize that when there's darkness, we cannot leave the darkness being dark, but we need to bring light to it. We cannot control what happened to us, but we can control how we react. We are the guardian of our mind. Just like we are the master of our homes that we can decide who gets to enter our home, who doesn't. Even when someone is banging and banging, trying to get in, you could decide not to let that person in. The same thing is with negative thoughts. When we have negative thoughts, dark thoughts, banging on our mind, we need to remember that we are the master of our mind. That we have the ability to control and not let those intruding thoughts disable us. As my great rabbi, the world Jewish leader, wrote me a letter when I was just 17 years old. He said, when you have intruding thoughts, don't fight it. Just dismiss it and have in your mind already stored away some words from the Bible, from prayers. Have some inspiration already in your mind so that when we do have these intruding thoughts, we can switch channels right away. Remember, PTSD is an event that occurred to us for whatever reason it occurred, but we survived to talk about it. And King David wrote, I did not die so that I can talk about it and grow from it. We have that power. You have that power. And together we will overcome the PTSD. We will overcome these intruding thoughts not to disable us and paralyze us, but to energize us. God bless you. God loves you.